Welcome back, folks. We are here at the 2022 Gold Coast Titans All Schools Touch event. I'm joined here in commentary by a couple of superstars, Harry McNamara and Rayrin Hayata. Welcome, gentlemen. Howdy, howdy. How are we? Awesome, mate. So we've got an 18 boys matchup out here on field one between Cleveland and Kedron State High School. The uh, nice Cleveland with the ball at the moment, taking the ball into the line for their tap off. But Hazza, you love a good game of touch, mate. Oh yeah. So oh, clear by McCullough. Sorry. Yeah. Yep. Not Tennessee Cleveland. Like tripped out. Been calling too many teams today. Oh, big bomb out to the left or right. Passes like you, Harry. Yeah, big Sydney Harbour Bridge. As, as we can see, the boys trying to work <laughs> it to the box. Oh, no, tap back at halfway. Nice. Alrighty. What a beautiful day it is to be playing some touch footy down here at one of the best competitions. The Gold Coast All Schools. Uh, we're in for a, a, a good treat of touch footy down here. Here comes the winger. Oh, looks like ball down was first. Have you got down foot? Ball down there first. Sure do. Oh, beautiful touch footy there. Good quality of touch footy going on here with the 18 boys. Number 50, Sam Kep. Boom, yeah, you'll see him there. So Matthew Wine ran away for the try there in the corner. Booyah! Just gets the ball down before the touch is made. Lovely. Nice, so Kedron scoring off their tap-off, mate. Game goes live now. Scores are one nothing in the 18 boys division. So you two boys both uh, here playing with Ormo Woods, is that right? Yep. Sure are. Yeehaw. How many games have you played already? Uh, just one. Okay, who'd you take on? Uh, Marymount. Oh, nice. There's a battle. Yeah. Cool. You would have known the boys from Marymount quite well. Yeah, I've played a bit of reunion against them. So. Ah, lovely. So Clevo McKillop just getting caught up there, about seven metres out from the line. And have you played either of these two teams before, gentlemen? Uh, no. I don't think so, no. Orange. No. Okay. No. Here we go, but a sweep of Ooh. platform. Boom. That's our nice. play. That's, <laughs> That's our tap-off play. <laughs> yeah, here very, we go. They look very familiar. Yeah. How can it be your play? You guys are like 12 years old. It's been around for 25 years, that play, gentlemen. <coughs> hey, here we go. Boom. Sweeper goes around. Step back Just to the short nice side. Whack there. Yeah. Short ball to the link. Opens up that massive gap. Nice. Alrighty, here we go, first touch. Got to get that momentum going. Scooper goes Ooh. through. Looks like it was just a bit of a miscommunication. Trying to be trick play off the tap, I think, there. James just took off like a gun. Boom, and left his team behind. Power pass in front of the rest of the play. So Clevo looking to punch away now. Coming through the middle of the field. Nice, got Jarvis Wang there. Arm goes out. Here we go, heading down into that seven metre line. Four and three platform, oh. short side. Oi. Another oh. whack, going to the short side. Sign of things to come, gentlemen. I think Nathan Byrne has warmed up that left foot. <laughs> yeah. Hey, here we go. Quickie. All right, just taking it slow at the moment. It's good, get the boys sorted. I right, see a little rooster play going in there. Ooh, just unlucky on that catch there. Just rooster play, however, they made on the on the link where you want the middle, so they weren't actually able to get the overlap there. Yeah, oh, here oh, we he's go. Gone through, he's gone through, the ref's called play on. Oh, and nice the <laughs> <in it>. <laughs> <coughs> I think we'll go back for the touch, it looks like. Yeah, they're tough, those ones, eh? Yep, definitely. There's a nice little chase down by the winger. Number 20, Theo Lang making that break there. We see a little scoop on the short side again. Late cut. That's Sam Kep again. Here we go. Looks like the Kedron boys are heading down into attack. Harry, what would you prefer to run in uh, this situation here when you're down on the seven? Uh, I can see that the... Uh, the Ooh, there oh, goes. there we go. The late Ooh, cut. Was that a oh, he's seven called last. Meter dive. It's called last. I can see that the defence is really one. tight, locked in. Uh, so I'd be looking for a couple of... 32 running options, so 32 wins or yep, staying definitely. live or rooster early release. Just get them running. Nice. When we talk about those plays, you say a 32 in. What does that mean? Uh, so that means the middle will fade towards a link. Okay. And he will he will then split in and be live with the ball. Okay. And that, here we go. that gives him that makes him a scoring option as well. Nice. Normally when the middle fades across and dumps the ball for the link channel, they split out and then we play back to the open side. Yeah. That's right. Cool. So we've got some good yards going here. The score remains one all. 
So it's a pretty tight game. Only first five minutes gone in. Nice. They're happy just to hang out with the ball here 15 metres out from the try line. I want them to get a little bit closer. They can start to manipulate the defence. Oh, there goes that whack again. Oh, <laughs> he's out of here. He's picked it oh. up. Put on the gas. Put on the Come gas. On. The Come trangle's on. out. Oh, he's going to find him. Oy. Nice hustle there <laughs> by the defending team. But here we have Kedron with uh, a whole lot of touches oh, in the dummy. Oh, wow. The old Clinical show footy. Clinical footy. So Jonah Dowling with the breakaway coming back and we see, I think that was Harry Kemp, wasn't it? Sneaking yep. over for the final try. Sure was. Well, Dowling gets it, gives it to Kemp. Kemp just goes, how you doing? Nice little dummy and nice go there. Nice little dummy. Sells it for a dollar. Everyone falls off. Wow, and that puts the Kedron boys up by one in a pretty tight game. Yeah. It's coming out of nowhere, so it's a bit of unorthodox touch footy, you know? So you've got one team looking to play touch and the other team looking to play footy. Yep. And it's sort of hard when they come up against each other. You're going Definitely. to see those crazy things happen. <laughs> Here we go. You see, ooh, ooh, ML platform there. Yeah, and the Kedron boys are pretty much man on if you look across the field. Yeah. So for those folks of you at home, when we say man on, man on is when I'm just going to mark my man and leave my other guys to look after themselves. Um, you find in touch, generally we don't mark man on, we mark spaces. We stand in tight on each other and help each other the whole way home. So, Rage, if you see you see a bit of defence, playing a bit man on, what's what's your go-to? Um, preferably, I'd like to go man on. Um, just so it, it's a bit more intense, you know, and a plus it gives gives me a chance to you know test my own skills on defence. So, um, I definitely like to go man on, but it all depends on what's uh, what's playing in front of you. So, yep. what it all comes down to what's going on if you call man on or or shut. So if you rock up against a team and they're defending against us with a bit of man on, what are you, what are you looking to run? Oh, mate, if they are looking to go man on, I Just think... Uh, that play there. Yep. Yeah. Stand in space that and chop a right hole. There. <laughs> or just put on the gas. There you put go. Put on the gas. There you go. Scoop through on one. Hey, that's our play, eh? Scoop through on one. Oh, yeah. There you go. <laughs> Did you say on one? Yep. That, the, yep. So Graham Clancy coined that years <coughs> ago. So he'd call it the Queenslander. And when you're losing by more than two, we would run Queenslanders every time. Yeah. So you get the ball on the first, dump for Clancy, and he just goes, Queenslander, down the sideline, sprint, scoops, length of the field. Yep, well, definitely, uh, we always have uh, my, <laughs> my partner next to me here going down for me because I'll always scoop. Oh, here we go. He's got the speed, here we like, go. like me. <laughs> <laughs> we, we, we know that on a Wednesday night when you play without me, we know you go get a bit lost out there. Oh, nah. stop it. The only problem is knowing where the ball's going to be dumped for you, though, Harry. Spiders. <laughs> nice, as we see Cleve on the clip, though, advancing towards the halfway line, getting their dump down, squaring the defence back up. Great drive. Yeah, there we go. Now they've got front foot momentum and they've got numbers on the Whoa. side. Oh, here we go. Little fast oh, oh, he sells them off. Footwork. Little check. Oh, oh was that, was that an early touch? Early touch. Oh, yeah, I gotcha. So we can uh, definitely see that the dummy is coming into play a lot from both sides of the teams. They're like a little bit of show and go. Oh, here we go, bit of ball playing. Ooh. Oy, why just, do we run a J line? Just unlucky. The link, the link's starting a bit too tight there and trying to run on the out. He needs yeah. to start wider and cut in. Run a nice J line there, eh? and that winger could have been in. So, still remaining at 2 all. We're all tied up. We're just waiting for that little game breaker to see which team uh, will chip away. Here we go. Scooping a bit Ooh. early. Is that six again? No, play on. Gaining some nice yards there. There we go, fifth and last play. What have they got in store? Oh, bit of footwork going on there. Just unlucky, but that's where you want to kill it. You want to kill it down at the other end. So we nice. see the boys just start to work to the box now. Need a little bit more intent trying to get to the box. The defense is just sort of rolling at the moment. No real shooting defense. Yep, looks like we're 10 minutes into the game and uh, oh, nice little pick up there by the referee. As the boys get a nice tap just after halfway. So Raids right now, what, what, what play are you looking to run? I'm looking to run a ML platform. Yep. But the uh, when the, the middle dumps the ball, I'll be getting it back um, and definitely having a crack at the line. Yep. 
Here we go. They got some touches uh, at the back of their sleeves here. Let's see what they can do. A little sweeper oh, play. Yep, sweeper platform. Going back to that sweeper platform. Oh. <laughs> Was he on side? That is a good question, Was he on side? Yeah, he's yep. called the play through. All clear. That he's called the play through. Good little pick up there. Let's just have a look at the replay here. Metal dumps the ball. Linker sweeping around. Notices that the middle was offside and just dives at the line. Yeah, middle just not quite pulling corner and Zach just sweeping right around the outside, sliding in over the trial. Even looked like the uh, the linker could have made the touch there. Yeah. But if uh, Leon Skinner was your coach in that situation, he probably would have told you to scream your undies off and call that touch. Ooh, oh. is, that a, is that a touch pass? Oh, oh what the? Oh. oh, surely a play on, surely. Are they going to award it? All clear. All clear. Oh, no. Campbell's called them back. So what's the chat going on here? Uh, what even happened? Just we, quietly. We, what even <laughs> happened? Do we got a, a, re a replay? What is on the ground. TMO. And then I just see the ball fly up between the legs. So we're just going to come back for a roll ball. Well, okay. All right, so it's Scoop. playing here. Looks like they got a few touches to play with. All playing, all just unlucky. Maybe just rushed it a little bit. Do you reckon you you would have took your time there on the line? Yeah, they had a few touches there that they've wasted. Oh, as we see, a bit of good flow here. Yeah, they, they just had, they had heaps of touches still left on the line. They didn't really challenge the defence at all. They just kind of threw it away on first. Mm. If Ashley Coburn was standing in the sub box and you did that, how do you think he would react? Oh, mate, if I was coming straight off the field, uh, I think I would have got uh, a hell of a, a talk from him. The old firm talking to him. Bit of quick hands out. That, that rooster platform could be on. Yeah, definitely. Especially going to those 32 plays, like yep. you mentioned earlier. Oh, is that a play on? Oh, he's called play on. That looked like a ball down there, but we're playing on to this moment. Nice yards. Oh, there you go. Sometimes you need those good power drives in. Oh, it looks like a, oh, we've got a man down. Ooh. Play it down. Oh. That's that Sam Keb. He's been involved in the first two tries for Kedron. That's the way, just walk it off. We have uh, another player replacing on. Let's see uh, see what the Kedron boys have got to try even it up. Nice driving there. A bit of argy-bargy yep. for the boys on the sideline there. Bit of banter <laughs> going on. Love to see it. That's what it's all about. All oh, the double footy. switch. Numbers. Oh, oh I had to knock it down. They had Here a we shot. Go. She's all on now. We've got six touches to play with. Let's see if uh, they use it wisely. Oh, sweeper's going around pretty early. Rugby league play. Now, I'd, like, I'd like to see the boys get back to that 32 platform. That rooster early release seemed to be working. Or just have a sweeper and hit the deck early. Make the ref yep. make a 50-50 call. Definitely. <laughs> Short side, and the boys have thrown it away. As we can hear from the box, the boys are going to the box. Ooh, nice nice hands. quick hands there, winger oh, but the winger has disappeared. He has bailed. <laughs> Here we go. Just Sometimes you're just tired, aren't you, Raids? Yep, definitely. A little bit of a chat here in the middle. Oh, so we're just taking a... Uh, two minute break guys because uh Ooh. So there must be a little bit of argy bargy bit of niggle going on. Yep. In these moments, mate, I think you just want to stay nice and quiet. Just let the ref do the talking because uh it can go pretty sideways um if you say anything back. So just a bit of respect. Yeah, and what you see, boys, one of the clever things about what Campbell does is the reason he talks to you for 30 seconds is it just takes the wind out of everyone's sails. Yep, definitely. So you get all pumped up and hyped up, and he's like, I'm just going to keep talking to you until your face changes. And once your face relaxes a little bit, then I'm going to let you go back to playing the game of touch. This uh, calms the situation oh, down, doesn't it? It calms everybody down. That's right. All right, the Kindred boys are pretty fired up here. They look like they want to put another point on the board. Starting um, to see some urgency here. Oh, you got oh. him. 
So we've just hit the 15 minute mark, boys, and you'll hear me saying the whole time throughout the commentary that this is the fatigue zone. Yep, in a normal definitely. 20 minute half of touch footy, it's five minutes before half time, isn't it? Yeah. Yep. Well, at all schools, that lasts for 10 minutes because yep. it's a 25 minute half. Yeah. So all the best tries I see running for most teams start to happen now. Yep, we can definitely uh, see that in our Ooh. team because uh, <laughs> one, one of our players, uh, T Dog, he'll probably uh, end up having a Big Mac by now or some <laughs> lunch. Yeah, absolutely the fatigue zone. So here we go. So three tries to two in the 18 boys matchup. Clevo McKillop over Kendron State High School. But Clevo can go out to a two try lead if they can nail one here. Okay, he's giving the link punish. Dummies oh, it. Oh, I should have given it. If he was if he was running on an out line. Oh, here we've got another two penalty. penalties. Yeah, I think Lockie Wixton had him. So he had him. He split really well. James was offside, but the half decided to take off and have a run. If the half had decided to give the P rip, the punish, dummy the punish and rip on the out. However, the other middle was just too tight. There you go. So not moving forward penalty in front of that wing channel. Nothing more frustrating as a middle than a winger giving away a not moving forward penalty on the line. <laughs> Here we go. He yep. says the same thing about the middles. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> yep, if that happens in our team, that's definitely a shout of a can of Coke. Yep. C1. Nice. So Nicholas out of half. Oh, Ooh, was that ball down? That ball down. Campbell's right there. Yeah, wow. he's cleared it. Yeah, he's cleared it. Clinical footy. Talk us through this one, Hazza. Uh, so we can see it's a C1 platform, so a middle sweeper. Sweeps around the link. Yep. So we got the number 11, Nicholas. From dummy Feed, half. Uh, from dummy half, feeds it early, gets low. Yeah, he just wasn't onside. Charlie Schultz eh, scores the big one. Man with his hands on his knees just there in the sub box. Mr. So Charlie. In these all schools games, getting up by two with only eight minutes remaining, it's pretty pretty hard to come back from this. It's not like at your NYC's where you've got another 20 minutes yep. to catch back up. Valid point. We've seen some pretty big scores in 25 minutes though, gentlemen. Yes. Yep. Well here on the field one game, so as, as well as some tight tussles. Yeah, been pretty impressive the touch. Ooh. As he goes around the back, wee. Just a little wee tricky plays, eh? The unorthodoxness of it. Even the hands through there could have oh, oh. maybe slotted them in for a try. Nice and James just trying to wiggle through. So we see referee says, hold on, roll ball, don't be <laughs> Oh, I like the bucket hat. Yeah, I like the bucket <laughs> hat. Digging the bucket yeah. hat. I tell you, you don't want a bucket, but it better have strings on it and it better be strapped to your head. I see. Oh, here he goes. Oh. Smart option, just pulling up. Oh, Ooh. there's that nice left foot whack there. It We've been seeing goosey. throughout oh. the game. But there was an ear walk there in the middle, wasn't there? It was a bit of a mixture of everything, wasn't it? Bit of fun there. Here we go, though. Ball out to the near side. Wants to use the offside player. He wants it. Punish. Well, is there a highlight Step back, reel? no one oh, there. Oh, wow. That was a good play. That was. Good yeah. IQ. Just your little link punish with the quarterback option. As we see, Nathan, Nathan, sorry, I cannot pronounce your last name, has the quickie with a step back and the fresh bucket hat, number nine, Jack Pratt. That's good, good variation. They, they'd run that link punish a few times now, so to chuck a quarterback option off of it, yep. good to see. That's uh, Australian standard footy right there in front of us, guys. Scoop on the first one for a switch. Quick turnover though by Clevo. You watch this. Like the little league oh, plays oh, they're oh, trying oh, to incorporate. Oh, whoa, whoa. Let's see the three. Little league, late, the late cut and then the swoop around the back. Up the sideline. Yeah, looking for a cheeky. Little sneaky up the sideline, hey? <laughs> Made world famous by Chico in 2017. That everyone in the game's claiming that. I thought you told me you created oh, it. Oh no, that's Chico all the way coming out of there. It is, look at this though, ball in two hands. Oh. Why don't we get a touch around the back though? Yeah, 35 claiming it. Got a touch call here. Referee has, the signal is that he has made the touch. Yeah, sorry gentlemen, but 2017 NYC, a young fella turned up with the New Zealand 16 boys team and ran that move like a hundred times for a hundred tries. No one had seen it before. And <laughs> within that season, we see the Redlands boys at Metro Cup running it, everybody running it, all over the place running it. It's sort, of a, it's sort of a one-shot try now. Well, yeah, I know, touch. but yeah, it just creates other options, the fact you've done it once, doesn't it? Yeah. Keeps that winger out. Yep. Nice. Kedra, no back hot on attack. Nice, just back nice. and forth forward. Oh, oh ball to ground off his back foot, unfortunately. Yep. We see the drive in them. They uh, they definitely have the energy and the 
the grit to try to get back into the game. It's just those little one percenters that uh, you know costing them the game here. So we'll see what they got in uh, defense here. Ooh. Tony with the dive, me on the outside here. Boys, oh, boys are a bit too far out to attack though. I think they they need to yeah. get a bit closer to that seven. It's just that little extra drive, the, the that extra meters again. just to get on the seven. Let's see what they got here. And if you look, everyone off the ball's not moving. Yeah, they're not moving unless it's coming towards them. You know. Oh yeah. Oh Try. wow. Yeah. Straight through him like Standing on the line. Yep. Try to time ball down. There it goes. So Clevo and McKillop have really broken, you know, since probably in the last five minutes, as we spoke about. Just taken off. Nice little pass off. Check back underneath. Gone. There you go. Nice. Right, so Kidron coming back to the halfway line for their tap off. So at one point, Kidron had the score back to three tries to two up against Clevo, but then they've just sort of broken off with three in the last five. So. Oh, we've got a oh, nice little scoop here. He's gone through. Bit of eyes up footy. Check, check. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, head. Oh, head. Unlucky. That was the idea, though, yeah. eh? You can see the, the, the yep. middle shot up out of the line early, trying to jam the person that he thought the ball was going to go through. And the, the active half picked up, threw the big dummy straight through him. Unfortunately, just couldn't connect just on that last finish. pass. Boom, so it's just a strong Oh, is he away? Way? I was with you guys, I don't know. <laughs> 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 Look, he went to thump it and he didn't, and oh, golly. Let's go. Number six, our little superstar yeah. here. Here we go, now he's gone this way. Those Four numbers. Oh, oh, they've taken it off him again. Can they've we have a TMO on again. that? Yeah. TMO? They look like not too bad, eh? Oh, yeah. <laughs> so, yep, got the full pass call there. Mm. Catching cool. boys on the ball. About nice. just under three minutes to go here. Poor fella on the wing, thought he had two runaways, both taken off him. So you see they're coming nice out of the options. box, plenty of energy. And see that guy took the touch, but it was a three on two, the link yep. stepped up to make it. So there's footy available, eh? Oh, nice little one hand short side. He's ne Link's never made the line there. Yeah, yeah as we see, him. there's the penalty. Nice little pick up by the referee there. I have noticed throughout this week so far, I haven't seen too many referees playing with the playthrough. So it's good to see that ref was considering the it's playthrough. It's been awesome yeah. here on field one, boys. Lots of advantage being played by all the referees. It's been great to see. As we said earlier, the greatest advantage is a try. So the referee can bring it all the way back to the infringement at any time. Oh, boom, got in him. between her. Ball yep. down, Wing all clear. Running, he shakes it off. The little in between us. Sweep wow. the dummy, short side, winger smashing a link line. The crowd is loving it. And it's really funny, gents, because we set that up as a trick play and touch. Yep. He just ran that move because it was the space. Do you yep. know what I mean? It's not a trick play. He's just got space in front of him. When you're chopping in yeah, into that Yeah, that's all hole. it is. They're just playing obvious space. So, Well done by Kidron there to pick up their try, taking the scores out to six tries to three. Let's see what they can do with this potentially second to last position of the ball by Clevo McKillop. Buckets is back out there. That's what you like to say. Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh it'll bounce out. Outside ball. Oh, Ooh. great defense by the winger. Yeah, quite happy just to sort of let themselves get towed up instead of getting around the ball, you know, the Kidron boys together. So it rushes up out of the line, but they're going to defend in one. C1 again. Here we go, that C1 platform. Got him on the pump. Got him on the pump. Wow. So Boom. we can see by the half, by take for the half taking two steps with the ball, it made the person pulling corner that link. Just hold that little bit. Just squared him up enough, wasn't it? Squared him up enough. As we see here, the, the half takes two steps, releases. And Buckets has a drive. Buckets is over. Yeah, yeah. There you go. Got to watch out for those guys with their hats back and the guys classic. with bucket hats, don't you? Speaking of buckets, I kind of feel like a bucket of KFC right now. Wow, there we go. It's only a Have you earned it? Have you earned it? No, he has not. Well, there you go. You can head up to the Vendor City, mate. There's some beautiful paella Ooh, up there. Had yes. some myself. Had some myself yesterday and today. Seen they were selling a couple of daggled dogs over there. I was like, mmm. Oh, I tell you. Oh, nice. Lane. Oh, oh ball. play on. Release. Oh, so six again. Count. 20 oh, seconds left. Yeah, Boys mate. just having a bit of fun. Let's see what they can do. Competitions One like this. One more against Ken. Here we go. Oh, Scooper. Just unlucky there. 
Well, they've definitely got energy driving yep. into the line, you know, driving deep into it, creating opportunities. But they've got probably one more roll of the ball, I reckon. There it is. Goosey goosey whack. There goes that final hurdle. Cool. Just unlucky. One of the best things I've ever seen at the end of the game was a player with the ball under his arm, puts his hand out to shake the other guy's hand, puts his hand out, pulls it in, whacks him, runs it into the field. Oh. Like, oh wow. It's always on until it's not on, gentlemen. Yeah. Cool. So, scores for that game there. <coughs> tries seven, tries to three. Clear by McKillop taking out that 18 boys match up against.